FNN. Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup. You are watching the 4 p.m. Stock Market Update. If you're just tuning in now, we're kind of going on to go over what we went through uh, during the show. You can go to TFNN uh, on YouTube right after the end of programming. We had a fantastic interview with Basil Chapman. Of course, he is on at 10 a.m. Eastern time for the Tiger Technicians Hour. And then, of course, we were joined uh, by Tim Ord of the Ord Oracle. Go ahead and check that out. If you do, make sure to give those videos likes and make sure to give our channel a subscribe. It helps us out uh, immensely. I was kind of just looking, you know, we were talking a little bit on the YouTube comment section about the potential, um, you know, maybe for some media rigging and this kind of stuff, especially on Poly Market and Kalshi with some of the wins. And uh, these comments on Poly Market are something else. You have some people being like, these are free scalps on Harris, great arb everywhere. Uh, certainly fascinating. And of course, you have DJT up 9.74%. Uh, I've been considered at some point, like if I got my own show, I started writing like some kind of newsletter, uh, going over some binary contracts. I actually do think like beyond for stuff like this, where it really is just betting, you know, I think of some of these binary options in a sense of like, uh, for one on Kalshi, for instance, right? They talk about like the price of lumber being in some certain range. Um, of course, you can kind of structure stuff like that if you want to play it. But I mean, you know, you think about that, like what if you make your living on, you know, driving lumber or something like that, right? And you, you know for a fact uh, you're going to get some kind of maybe lower paycheck. There's less lumber going on there. You can kind of hedge that loss uh, with things like these these binary options, uh, which I think is kind of neat. And I always like uh, the ability to, you know, to engage in different financial vehicles. Uh, but then, of course, you get things like, is it going to rain in Manhattan at, at 12 p.m.? And people will bet on uh, absolutely anything. Uh, so that's pretty fascinating. Let's see where we end the day. We have the composite up about 0.18%. The Dow Jones Industrial up uh, off about 0.02%. That dollar strong up 0.19% at 104.12. You have crude oil strong at 2% to the upside, trading at 71.46. That E MIDI off 0.11%. The gold contract making all time highs again up about 0.85% at 2,761. Silver doing well. Russell off. Tomorrow's another day. Thanks for joining us, guys. We'll be back tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. with Tommy O'Brien, morning market kickoff. Take care.